Hi guys, welcome back and today I'm going to show you my CTEC fire alarm control panel. This is what it looks like. You can see it looks pretty good in aesthetics wise. It is two zone conventional. I know it sounds basic, but two zone is it's, it's fine as a starter because I don't have any devices apart from this switch, uh, which is used as a call point. Uh, fire alarm people, you probably already know this, but um, there's the resistors. I know it looks a bit of a mess. Uh, let me get a bit neater, actually. So um, there's the switch. Um, so those are the wires. They go in through that 6K, which is to make sure the fire alarm panel doesn't go in fault. And there's two 200 ohm resistors. Um, you probably already know this, but if there's a 400 ohm resistance across the zone, then it goes into alarm. You probably already know that. I was just saying, if you didn't, and I got a power power plug um, to plug it in. I'm not going to be switching it on in this video. However, whenever um, I get some devices, I'll be doing my first system test. Uh, let's have a look on the inside. So there's two screws here. There's a key switch, you know, the buttons, uh, all the lights, things like that. So let's open it. So here we have it. So we've got the mains, which just goes in here through this transformer. And here is the circuitry. You can see. Pretty cool. And there's the piezo. So this is the wire. Um, I couldn't find another uh, resistor to put across there, so it comes up as a um, fault on there. Um, but that's fine. I'll try and get a resistor f um, for that one. When these zones are being used, I'll probably put um, resistors across there. So yeah, here's just information there if you want to read it. Um, the key switch actually came the key for the key switch actually came uh lost unfortunately so i have to use this um alligator clip here to short it out so the panel knows that um i can use it you know uh there's the relay i'll just give you a quick overview of the circuit there's a heat sink for those switching transistors i'm assuming which is nice actually let me just show you, uh, so it was manuf manufactured in Great Britain, which is pretty cool actually, 1988. So how old is that? That's like um, 32 years old. Yeah, so hopefully I will be getting some devices and eventually in the future I'll also get some uh, batteries as well. So, um, I'll probably get a probably a sounder and a smoke detector um, and probably a cool point as well. I'll probably get three of each device just to start off with um, and then we can do the system test. Now talking about system tests, I actually have a uh, giant, not a giant, but like a large wooden board where I can actually put all this stuff on and showcase it rather than just being scattered all over the floor. Okay guys, this is what I've got for you today. Thank you for watching and see you later. Stay tuned for more content in the future.